Dude, mate, how you going? I'm fantastic. Listen, we're just checking out the dad vibes at Good Things today. Um, how's the dad vibe today? Oh, mate, there's some special cats out here today, mate. There's all sorts. Have you seen a few Devo bands? Oh, mate, there's buckets absolutely fucking everywhere. <laughs> Who's your must-see band of the festival as a dad? Oh, mate, it has to be Limp Bizkit and Spider Bait. Limp Bizkit and Spider Bait? Yeah, yeah. That's a deadly combo for dads. Tell us. What's the important, as a dad, what's the important music related brag that you tell your kids? Well, that's a fucking cracker, that. That is an absolute cracker. Hey, <laughs> uh, Dad, dad, dad he, he, Obviously, up. not dad a dad, or if he's a dad, it doesn't even matter. They probably don't know who he is. <laughs> Oh mate, it'd be hit, hitting the pit with corn back when they first toured in Australia, it was brilliant. How good was that? My, my brag is Pantera and Metallica on the Black Album, but my kid's three doesn't care. <laughs> mate, thanks for your time, have a great festival. Legend. G'day, I'm here with Rick Montana. And we're checking out Dad Vibes at Good Thing. How's the Dad Vibe going today, man? Yeah, yeah good, good, she's loving it. She's birthday loving present it. for her. This is her birthday present. It's a birthday present, 16th birthday. How old are you? 16. No way. Good on you, mate. Mate, you might just get father of the year. <laughs> it's her gig, so I'll just follow her around whatever she wants to see. We've seen uh, Bullet for My Valentine, Corey Taylor, I Prevail, a couple over in the small tent, a couple, yeah. couple of little bands underneath the stadium. Mate, cool. you've got the whole experience. Yeah, it's great. It's that, so I'm going to ask you both, who's the must-see band of the day for you? Oh, uh, look, I think so far the best band I've seen is Bullet for My Valentine, but... Yeah. She wants to see Limp Biscuit tonight, so that's what we're here for. I'll see you in the pit. Limp Biscuit, and I want to be in the pit, but I might die. So. Yeah, it's a pretty hectic pit, but oh, you got this big fella to keep you keep you safe. Yeah, the pit looks pretty wild over there. Oh, you'll be right, mate. Is there any important music brag that you've given your daughter, like that she doesn't care about? Like I always tell the young kids, I saw Pantera back when they were Pantera, and they're like, no way. What's your what's your wild brag? Oh, I've seen Pantera too. Um, She's a muso, so I can't really brag to her. She's always bragging to me and teaching me new things about modern music. How good's that? How good's that? <laughs> yeah, great. No worries. Well, thank you, Hoots, for your time. Happy birthday. You. You're a legend, mate. Dad of the year. Yeah. Fuck yeah. <laughs> How are you? Oh, <laughs> that was awesome. Are you right, bro? I'm all right, bro. I'm good. Get out of here. Get that thought out of there. Hey, anyway, you're a dad. I'm a dad, mate. Yeah. What's your name? Wyatt. Wyatt. Fuck Wyatt Earp. That's a great name. It's a cool name. So what'd you call your kid? Uh, we're nerds, so my daughter's name's Ahsoka from Star Wars. Yeah, I'm with that. Yeah, cool. Yeah. How's the dad vibe for you today, man? The dad vibe? I'm missing her, bro. I am. I'm missing her. Oh, how I struggle. Old is, how old is she? How she, old is she? She's three. So I was a stay-at-home dad for two years. And now it's really hard for me to leave a space like this, but I got to, you know. Yeah, you got to. The experience, bro. Well. When, when she grows up, what is your, your important music brag that you're going to tell her over and over again until she's sick of it? That I seen Limp Bizkit, of course. And I did it all for the nookies. <laughs> I don't even need to ask, but who's your must-see um, band of the festival? It, it's Limp Bizkit. It's, I've wanted to see Limp Bizkit since I'm four years old, and I finally get to see him. So this is Bizkit. your first run? It's my first time seeing him. First time. 100%. You bloody legend. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, well, you met pseudo Fred Durst. Yeah. Now you're going to see Limp Biscuit. I like it. Good on you, brother. G'day. What's your name, mate? My name's Chris. How are you? I'm fantastic, Chris. I'm just um, I'm out here with all the dads checking out the dad vibe today. How do you find the dad vibe? Oh, it's up there. There's a lot of dads getting around. I have to ask, who's your must-see band of the festival? Must-see band? Uh, it had to be Luke Biscuit. That's that's what we're here for. Slaughter to prevail. Pennywise, uh, Corey Taylor. He always good. And they all destroyed. Yes, absolutely, absolutely. Tell us, as a dad, what's your important music-related story that you're going to tell to your kids over and over again? Oh, they, mate, there's hundreds. There's hundreds. I saw the OG Slipknot at River Stage. I watched a girl get her leg broken in the pit. Uh, yeah, I've been to every single good thing. That is the best brag of all time. Yeah, every single uh, sound wave. Uh, seen the OG blink, you know, 
everything. Mate, your dad vibes are perfect. You're a legend, Chris. Good on you, man. Cheers. G'day, I'm here with this guy with the longest neck in Australia, Luke the Goose James. How are you, mate? Yeah, I'm good, bro. How are you? Where do you get your good looks from? The James family. That's good right, bro. the James family. That's our family. He's my brother. Um, you're a dad. you got a brand new kid, sort of, a couple years old. How's the dad vibe today? Oh, it's pretty good. You know, I think many dads are rocking out their bonds. You can see, you know, a bit of the guts, a bit of this, a bit of that. You know, it's all going on. Oh, even I understood that. Um, who is your must-see band of the festival? Pennywise. Who else? Uh, I mean, I prevail. Corey Taylor. Bull from a Valentine. Yeah. How good is it? And also, when Harley, the greatest kid. Sec oh, nearly the greatest kid of all time, mine might be. What is going to be your important music brag that you tell him? That my brother got to interview so many band members that I fucking look up to. Hey, did I tell you that I interviewed Pennywise today? Yeah. And you know what? I was sitting with Randy and Fletcher having a beer and um, Randy ate Pringles out of this can and I'm giving the rest of them to you Oh, you can give something to Campbell if you like. Oh, God. You're going to share some Pennywise Pringles with Campbell? <laughs> yeah. Come here, come. <laughs> How good are good things? Whoa!